Welcome back to American Latino TV. Up next, we have an amazing story of Dulce Candy Tejada, and yes, that is her real name. Okay, after crossing the U.S.-Mexican border with her mother and two sisters at the tender age of six, she grew up fast in Southern California and later joined the military right out of high school. She was even stationed in Iraq. Now, when she returned home, Tejada worked as a mechanic, and considering all the boyish things she has tended to do, she began making videos about fashion as a way to connect with her more feminine side. And one million YouTube followers later, a star is born. Check this out. It's Lucy Candy, a story you will definitely only find right here on American Latino TV. Brought to you by Maybelline New York. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Maybelline. Hey guys, so I'm back and I'm here to show you my entire makeup collection plus organizing tips. At first glance, one might say Dulce embodies what it means to be girly. And this one is called Confessions of a Beauty Guru. But beneath the ultra feminine exterior is a young woman who found her drive to pursue a career in fashion after taking on some very masculine endeavors. I always loved fashion growing up. I just couldn't really afford it. Um, my parents didn't really have extra money to just give me to buy clothes and stuff. Trust me, I'm not the person to collect makeup and just let it sit there and just get old and expire because I feel really bad when I have something and I don't use it. I was born in Mexico, in Michoacan, and then at the age of six, my mom and my sisters, we all came to the United States. Um, and then I moved to Oxnard, and then I joined the military right after high school. What? She's waving. I joined the military at the age of 18 because I didn't really know what, what I wanted to do with my life. I couldn't really pay for college, so I thought maybe going to the military, since they pay for college right after you get out, I thought that was a good idea and I was completely stripped away from like everything girly I mean I couldn't wear what I wanted to wear especially when I was in Iraq I was in a uniform 24 7 that's when I really started to have a huge passion for it because I was like yearning it you know I started doing YouTube videos I wanted to do a makeup video kind of showing you what I do my routine for work that's all I do for my makeup the not a lot of makeup, just subtle makeup that's gonna make me look better than looking all dead. Which just reached a million subscribers, which is pretty awesome. Today I'm doing a very special announcement for reaching one million subscribers on YouTube. Filming YouTube videos was actually like a way for me to just step outside of the military world and really feel feminine and interact with other girls who share the same passion. But the funny thing is that whenever I get in front of a camera, like for like, I don't know, like television or a show or something like that, or an interview, I... My heart starts beating really fast. When I appeared in Seventeen Magazine in 2008, and that was like the biggest opportunity that I had, like the first big opportunity. And then I appeared in the August issue of Seventeen Magazine, and ever since that moment, like my whole life changed. One quote that I really love is, the better you feel, the better life gets. You know, my inspiration comes from all different places. I, like, it could be watching a movie from the 1920s and, like, a hairstyle or a certain look will just, like, strike, strike something inside of me to, you know, that inspires me. Basically, anything that I see on the street, too. I think it's the passion, and I'm also very relatable to the everyday girl. Um, I feel like they can come to my blog and feel like I'm a sister or, like, a best friend, because that's how I like to talk to them, because that's the kind of relationship I have. I just think being really relatable and seeing me succeed, I feel like they can really feel inspired and know that, you know, just being a regular girl like myself, they can do it as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.